Hi, I'm Michi from Marker. I am responsible for the R&D at Marker and I'm here with Backcountry Skiing Canada.com um, and we are here in Courmayeur for launching our new Alpinist Pining. Um, as you see already here it's a super lightweight product. We have a 115 gram toe and a 130 gram heel so altogether 245 gram. Um, you immediately see twin springs not the six springs like we had before. Um, lightweight carbon material toe. There's an option for the crampon. You could use it with the crampon or without the crampon metal part here. Um, you see anti-ice pads in the front and in the heel. So that's a very unique feature. No problems with icing up the binding anymore. Then if we go to the heel, you see here classic pin heel. You could use it like a race binding on the 5 degrees climbing aid position or as an other option you use it in this position then you have a zero degree walking option or you have the climbing aid uh, option with nine degree climbing aid and you shift it back to a fast shift position so you can just do it with the pole into the climbing aid or out so very good usage uh, for the climbing aids. Also what you see here is the thin setting because the binding there is available uh, 12 binding with the thin setting 6 to 12 and also there is available a 9 binding with thin setting 4 to 9. 4 is really cool because light ladies or young skiers and tourists already can start to use a pin binding now. Yeah. Hope you have seen the most important things um, on the binding and yeah, we enjoy it to use the binding in the coming month. The base plate of the toe is made out, out of nylon with a long carbon fiber filled and this was a real challenge to develop this part because normally if you inject above a hole and then the material flows around the metal pin you always have a weak point into the part and here we use a super unique technology we fill the part and afterwards in the mold the pin comes forward and press the hole in the mold so this is why we don't have weak spots up here and we were able to uh, design this part out of a carbon material not as a metal base plate as normal bindings do the alpinist also has a break, break option for sure um, as you see the brake, if it close, come in, comes in very nice. So, and now how the brake is working when we use it for walking, you just push forward this metal and then you could step on and the brake is closed for walking. So, after walking, you just go back with this pin and the brake is open again. So, really nice mechanism. Um, and the brake will come in a 90, 105 and 120 width.